Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Christy. I'm a homeschool mom to three, and today I am sharing what I got my kids for Christmas. So first of all, I want to apologize for my voice. Once again, sickness has hit our household, but I really wanted to get this video filmed and up for you guys because I know it's getting so close to Christmas. And if you are still shopping, you can get some ideas from this or maybe some last minute ideas and that sort of thing. So I have three kids and their ages are 11. He will be six at Christmas. His birthday is in just a couple weeks. His birthday is actually a week before Christmas. And then I also have a three year old little girl as well. So I have two girls and a boy, and I'm gonna share with you what we got our kids for Christmas. So I'm gonna start with the youngest and go up to the oldest. First thing, we have started a newer tradition. Last year we did this for the first time, and Christmas Eve, we actually allow them to open a present. And this gift is always some kind of board game or game that we can play as a family. So each kid gets a new board game, and that's really fun because we usually go over to my mom's house for Christmas Eve, and we like to play games, and so it's fun to have a new one to play. So this year, my youngest is getting Getting Candyland for her game and I think that Candyland is going to be a really good game for her you know she's just starting to kind of understand and be able to play some more complex games like this but this isn't too complex because she knows her colors and I can help her like move her piece and stuff and I think she's gonna really like this so we always do one Santa gift every year each kid gets one thing from Santa and then the rest of the things are from us for the Santa gifts I always try to like do kind of like a theme in a way. So this year's theme is create or creativity. And so Isla is getting this Play-Doh Kitchen Creations pizza set. So this is really cool because you can put the Play-Doh, like the brown Play-Doh down and then the red Play-Doh on top and then you push this down and it mushes it down so it looks like there's sauce. And then this little thing grates some cheese on top and then you can make little toppings and cut the pizza. I think she's gonna really, really love this. She loves Play-Doh so much and she's also really into pretending to make pizza. So I think that this is gonna be perfect for her. The first thing that we got her is this Barbie Chelsea camper set. And she's actually just starting to get really into Barbie dolls and really, really enjoy playing with them. And so she, I thought, would really like the little Barbie, the Chelsea doll. And this set is so cute. It's like a little camper that opens up and inside there's like a bed or two beds and like a little kitchen and stuff and then there's a little car that she can pull her camper with it comes with a little dog and some little accessories and I think she's gonna really love this the next two things that we got her kind of go together um, I might wrap them together I haven't decided yet but these are some dress-up dresses so another thing that she's getting really into is she loves to play dress up and she has a few um, like hand-me-down dress up clothes that we've got for her. They're all getting really pretty small on her and we actually, this brand is Little Adventures and we have one dress from this company that we absolutely love. It's soft, it's um, glitter free and the material, like I said, is soft. Like this is like a velvet, it's like comfortable, it's not stiff or scratchy. They are machine washable and you don't have to worry about them like getting torn or anything in the washer. They also are lifetime guaranteed. So these dresses are so pretty. I got this blue one. I think it's like a Cinderella butterfly one or something. Um, and they were having like a really good sale for Black Friday. So I ended up getting both of these dresses for like what it would cost to get one. They are a little bit pricier than the ones that you get at like Target, but they are very much worth it, especially with their lifetime guarantee. And if you have a little girl or a little boy, they have boy dress up things too, um, that loves dressing up and like lives in their dress up clothes and gets dirty, all sorts of things. These are definitely worth it. So this really pretty blue one and then this really pretty pink and like gold one 
super, super pretty. The last thing that we got my three-year-old is this set of twin dolls. These are by Baby by Batat. So Batat makes these. Um, this brand here, they make really cute dolls and doll accessories that are a little bit less like like gaudy in colors and stuff. So they have like some neutral colored clothing. They have some really cute like nursery sets and that sort of thing. Um, so these are twins and I thought that these would be really fun for Isla because she is obsessed with the dolls and her babies, like that's what she plays with all day long are like her babies. And so she loves caring for her babies. She does not have a twin set and I just thought that she would really kind of love having like siblings like that, being twins and being able to care for them. And I thought they were adorable. So we have a girl twin and a boy twin. Um, they also have like a couple different races as well. And like I said, accessories. So definitely go check them out. They're very affordable too. Like I was surprised by how affordable they were. Were. So super cute. I think you can get them at Target and you can also get them at Amazon. I've seen them, Kohl's, that sort of thing. So it comes with like little binkies that pop in their mouth. But yeah, so cute. Okay, so now we're going to move on to my six-year-old son. And for his game for Christmas Eve, I got him the Floor is Lava game. They love like pretending to play this game and they will use like couch pillows, like just random objects that are on the ground, like the bins that all of like our magnet tiles are stored in, like, like random things. They will use that to play the floor is lava. So I thought that they would really all enjoy playing the actual game. It comes with all these little colored like squares and you actually have a spinner to spin to tell you what square you have to jump to or something like that. I'm not entirely sure, but it looks really fun and I know that all the kids are gonna love it. I love games like this to kind of get their energy out for sure. For Emmett and his Santa gift, his creativity gift, he's actually gonna be getting Aqua Beats. Now, I thought that this would be something that he would really like. He loves doing like meticulous little things and little projects and he's becoming quite the little creative bug. So, I thought that he would enjoy this. It comes with a little pen, you put the little beads in there if you're not familiar with these, they're similar to what like perler beads would be, except you don't actually have to use an iron, which is awesome because then I don't actually have to have a part in this, like he can do it on his own. You actually just use spray, like you, a little spray bottle and water and it makes them stick together. I don't really know how they work, but they look fun. And it comes with like different patterns he can follow. It comes with like, this is like a starter kit. So it's got like a tray that you put all the beads on and he can make all different kinds of little things. So they also have like expansion kits um, where they have like more patterns and more beads and sets and stuff that you can kind of add to it. But yeah, I thought he would really like this and I love, like I said, that it doesn't require an iron. His first gift from us is this uh, Circuit Explorer Rocket Set. This is from Educational Insights and I stumbled across this by chance. And what's cool about this is it's basically like your first circuit kit. So it teaches them about circuits and electricity and like, like pathways to make things work, but in a very understandable, six-year-old kind of way. And so this comes with all these different pieces for the rocket and the rocket has to be put together a certain way for the lights and different things to work on it. It also has like this little like rover and these little people that are adorable, these little astronauts. Um, so cute and he's actually getting another set to add to this from my brother and his wife. They're getting him like the big space station. So it's like this but there's even more little circuits and like it's a whole space station. And I think that this looks super fun and I think he's gonna really enjoy playing with it because the different circuits make different things happen different lights different like things move and that sort of thing the next gift we got him is this uh, light tracing board from discovery so my son is getting really into art he loves to draw and paint and that sort of thing and 
like he never used to. It's kind of a newer thing. He's just really into it now. And I taught him how to trace by taping pictures on the window. But I thought it would be really cool to get him a light board so he doesn't have to stand and tape it to the window. He can just use it whenever he wants, just on the table. And so I think it comes with some papers that you can put inside and trace it. But they also, you can like use whatever papers you want. What's cool about this one too is it's got a little drawer with little colored pencils that can go in there um, and a little place for a pencil on the back. So I thought that this would be something that he'd get a lot of use off and really enjoy. The last gift that we got Emmett is this blue track. So this is going to be really hard to describe without opening it. This is basically like a continuous plastic racetrack and it's got two sides so you can run two cards at the same time um, but what's cool about it is it just rolls up and then you unroll it and you can actually fold it over itself to make like loop-de-loop it's actually like a little hook and suction cup on one side so you can suction it to a window for height so that you can get the cars going real fast um, so I thought that this would be really cool because Emmett loves cars like most boys do. He has a lot of Hot Wheels tracks, um, but he doesn't really gravitate towards playing with them. And I think main, the main reason is because he has a little bit of trouble putting them together the way that they're supposed to be put together. And so with this, he doesn't have to put anything together. It's a continuous track. He can make it go up and over things like your wobble board or up and over the couch. Like it's really, really cool. Go look up some videos on YouTube about Blue Track because it looks really fun and I think definitely a toy he could like spend hours playing with for sure. Okay, so my 11 year old this year has been probably the hardest. She actually didn't like ask for a lot this year and some of the things she asked for were like super simple but it is what it is when you have that like in between age it's sometimes a little bit hard to buy for so her game gift is Catan Jr. Um, so I got the junior one not necessarily because like you know she, I know she's old enough for the original one but I want her to be able to play with her brother so I thought the junior one would be a better fit maybe he could catch on a little bit better I'm not sure I've never played this game before I don't know how complex it is but it is like a story game and I really enjoy those types of games when they have a story or a strategy and so I thought this one would be a fun one for her to play, you know, with her brother. I don't even know what the ages are on this. Oh, this says it's for ages six and up. So maybe he can play this pretty easily. I'm not sure, um, but I know that I'll enjoy playing it with her too. So this is her game gift. Her Santa gift this year is this Klutz So Mini Treats kit. Um, and so this is like a bunch of little like food people with eyes that she can learn to hand sew. She's been interested in learning how to sew with like just a needle and thread and also the sewing machine and so I thought this would be a good kit to kind of start that process. So it comes with everything that you need in here, thread, needles, all the felt and the stuffing and teaches her how to make all these little cute little treats and stuff so I think she'll love that. So Lacey got a Nintendo Switch last year and so we got her Pokemon Diamond game and these games are so expensive like I hate buying switch games they're like 60 bucks um, there's also another one I got with this one it is like a how to train your dragons game and that one I actually got on a super sale I got it for like 20 bucks so that one's not here yet though so she's getting two switch games another thing that we're getting her for Christmas is a heated blanket she asked for one for Christmas it is not here yet but I'll pop a picture up here of the blanket that we're actually getting her it looks super soft and fuzzy I love this blanket because you can unhook it and machine wash it which was something I definitely wanted so Lacey is my crafter she spends the majority of her day doing some kind of project whether it be like a clay project or something with felt or she's building some kind of like world or habitat in a cardboard box with like the hot glue gun she just is always making something and so I thought that this would be kind of a fun gift this is uh, the scribe 3d 3d pen and from my research on this it seems very kid friendly 
Um, it seems like one that a lot of kids get first and it seems like it's really good quality. So basically this is like a heated pen. It does get hot so make sure your child knows that. And it has, it comes with um, like these little plastic threads. I don't know if you can see those, but all different colors. And you thread it in the pen and then use the pen and you can draw things and then like build upon it to make it into like a three dimensional object. Um, it looks super fun. I've never used one before. I don't know how like uh, hard they are to use, but if anybody can figure out how to make this work, it's her. She like is amazing with like crafty intricate things. So I think that she's gonna really enjoy it. From what I know, it does actually come with some like paper templates that you can practice on and make different things, but you can also just make, you know, whatever you want um, and buy more thread and that sort of thing. So I thought this would be fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what we got our kids for Christmas. They also have a lot of family members who like to buy for them for Christmas too. So they'll be getting some other things as well. But this is, this is what we got them this year. I hope you found some ideas maybe. Happy shopping. Hope you have a wonderful day. Merry Christmas.